Hey Dan, what do you know about the pencil tool in Sketchable? Today we're going to learn about the most amazing tool in Sketchable, the pencil tool. What is it? How do we use it? And why do we need it? This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM. That's me. I am a 2D illustrator, and today I'm gonna walk you through the Pencil Tool and Sketchable app. Let's get started by opening the Sketchable app that you can find in the Microsoft Store available on all Windows 10 devices. As you can tell, we are back in the page I last left when I was here in Sketchable. So let's go ahead and explore my most favorite tool of all the pencil. Let me go ahead and change out this layer. Boom, boom, plus, and take a look at this tool right here. That's it, that one, that one, right there, the pencil. What's cool about the pencil is that it gives you a great range of sketching little, little things and little ideas, and it mimics the actual living pencil that you're used to in real life. If I go ahead and switch my color, there it is, and look, I slowly build out my drawing. I can then change the flow, change the opacity, and keep working. There we go. <laughs> oh yeah. Man, what I like about the menus in Sketchable is that they get out the way. Look at that, they get out the way. <laughs> there we go, here goes a little bit of the pencil. And of course there's a ton of pencils settings already set. Here's the edgy pencil. Then we got the crispy pencil. So let's go ahead, get in a little tighter. Oh yeah, I like that. Oh, that's one of my favorite ones. I do like the crispy pencil. And then we got the hard pencil. The pencil brushes that have these effects re remind me of what it looks like when I'm drawing on paper. So this one is called the soft pencil, the chisel tip pencil. What do we got? Oh yeah and I can make that bigger so I can see the difference. Oh man, look at that. Uh, the scratch board, oh, look at that. <laughs> nice, what is happening here? And of course, it's, it responds to pressure as you can tell by some of the settings that are here in the menu. Wow. Let's try the soft number two. Oh, look at that. Then the soft, oh, whoa. So soft two and soft two. So that's a couple of different soft twos and a soft two also. And what these are is that they just have different settings that we know we can adjust out here on the side. And the last one is this number two pencil. My most favorite, yes. What's up, number two? There we go, oh, look at that. So that depends on your pressure. Oh, let me go ahead and go here, and now. <laughs> Woo, this is cool. Come on, come on. Oh, now, I, I love the way a pencil looks on the screen, so I do very minimal setting adjustments on the right-hand side. I'm only looking for the things that are gonna help me make my drawings a little bit better, a little bit cleaner, and so I'm not gonna change the shape. I'm barely gonna touch this profile. Let's make it really sharp. Let's see what happens. Let me see if we can, oh yeah, big difference. Yes, that's cool, I like that, but I like this texture better, so I'm gonna go back to where it was before, right there. Uh-huh. Uh oh, <laughs> what happened? It was this one, it was this one. I'm gonna go ahead and click on restore, and boom, let's try it. There it is, there we go. We're gonna make it really big, and look at that, oh yes. Awesome. So there it is, a long range of pencil brushes available here in the pencil menu. It's your turn to explore and try out the pencil brush that's gonna help you the most to create your artwork. 
This is Digital Drawing and Sketchable with DTM, and I hope that today's tips are helpful in expanding your digital drawing creativity. Please share, like, and subscribe for more Sketchable insights. See you next time. Come on, pencil. Let's go back to my main pencil. Yes, the number two.